the opioid crisis hit Kentucky particularly hard and addiction numbers prove it. So the state is now holding the companies who played a role in all of this responsible. One of those settlements will bring hundreds of millions of dollars in for recovery efforts. LEX 18's political reporter Carolina Buchek has tonight's big story at 530. Easy access to opioids fueled a crisis here in Kentucky. So many families have been left struggling with addiction, but now there's money coming into the state that could help them. Starting this spring, Cardinal Health, McKesson, Amerisource Burgeon, and Johnson & Johnson will begin compensating Kentucky for creating and fueling the opioid epidemic. Attorney General Daniel Cameron said Kentucky is getting its part of a $26 billion settlement with groups involved in opioids. So exactly how much is Kentucky getting? $483 million, and that money is going to be used to help people struggling with addiction. A struggle Taylor Neese remembers vividly. It became a problem, and I just I couldn't quit. She says opioids ruined many years of her life, and it took a long time to get herself on the right track. After seven rehabs and praying every single day, laying on those cold, hard jail floors, for 10 years, I finally accepted myself for who I was and what I had done. She now shares her story in hopes that other people struggling know that there is help. And thanks to Kentucky's new settlement money, she believes more people than ever before will be able to access that help. All these treatment centers are here. Like, they're here to help and just come and find it. So don't give up, help is there. In Frankfurt, Carolina Butrak, LXCT News.